in a huge fire today that swept a shopping centre, massive one, in the uh, Russian city of Kemerova. 69 are said to be missing, including dozens of children. It seems to be getting worse as the hours are going on, although the fire, it looks like, is under control. The number of dead and the actual picture of what's happened there has got progressively worse. It has the fire began, obviously, late morning, early afternoon in the city of Kemerovo in southern uh, Russia. It was a uh, shopping centre, four floors tall, and the fire, we understand, began on one of those top floors there in what we understand is a children's play area, mm. a ball pit, a trampoline pit of some sort with flammable material. Um, uh, the cause is too early to speculate, but the deputy governor has said one possible theory uh, was careless use of a lighter or some sort of accident That's with a lighter. That's kind of odd for a start, because of course here in Russia, smoking, that kind of thing's banned in all public places, mm. but you never know, maybe kids have got a hold of something like that. But we don't know, it's early days, isn't it's it? It's early days, and obviously firefighters have isolated the fire, they've got things under control. Uh, what they are doing now is obviously taking part in a uh, recovery operation there. They've cleared the first two floors, they're working on the third one. They could couldn't get to the fourth floor for quite a while, we understand, because of the sheer uh, high temperature there, just to give you a picture of what was going on. Paint a picture of this sort of building. It's one of those kind of uh, mm. cinema, bowling alley, shopping complexes, a big place. Yeah, big shopping centre. Sunday would have been filled with families, many children inside, and this is perhaps one of the most tragic things we saw there. The casualty figures, uh, 69 uh, have uh, been declared missing so far. We understand from latest information as many as 40 of them, uh, more more than half are children aged 2 to 13, very tragically. Uh, we understand uh, that fire escapes uh, may not have been working properly, the alarm systems may not have been working. Uh, the woman there saying that the cinemas effectively became death traps. People uh, were not given any help to go to, to exit the area. A lot of panic inside. One can just imagine, uh, you know, the sort of sheer terror that would have been going through those people's minds. So um, 69, as we say, missing, hopefully as many as possible of those, of course, will be accounted for safe and sound. Uh, it's going to be a long night, certainly those for the relatives and friends of those uh, currently unaccounted for on the top floors.